Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Today I'm gonna to be demonstrating how to add color swatches to your cosmetic product in Shopify. Specifically for if you have a specific type of product where you need to add color swatches or additional version of that product. Let's get straight into this video. To get started, I'm gonna show you how to open up a product and how to add the different color swatch options or the different shade options for the product. You'll want to first open up Shopify and then click products. This is where you can open up an existing product or you can create a brand new product inside your website. I'll be opening up an existing product and you should be directed to your product editing page where you can make changes to your product and customize the product listing. You'll want to scroll down until you see the variants section. This will be the section in which you can add the different sizing and color options for your product. I'm gonna click add options like size or color and for this example lipstick product, I'm gonna select color. This is gonna represent the color swatches. Under variant, you should see an example of the first variant listed. To customize that, you'll want to click on the main variant option and here where you see multicolor, you can edit this or you can replace it or add a new one. I'm just gonna add a new color and then I'm gonna remove this. I'm gonna title this color coral pink, then I'm gonna click add coral pink. It's gonna now represent this as a new color option for the product. You can change the color settings to match the specific tone of the color swatch option. And you can also upload an image to represent this color. I'd recommend uploading an image of your product in that specific shade or a swatch of the product. Once you're done, you'll want to click save to save that new variant. And I'm gonna remove this first one. That's just an example of how to add one variant or color swatch. You should see that new variant added and this is where you can also add the same image to represent the color and you can set a different price for the item in case for an example you would like each different variant that you added to have different prices. You can also set the inventory amount that you have for each variant. You can repeat those steps to add multiple different colors for your product. Next we're going to take a look at the product and I'll also show you how to stack variants. You want to go in to customize your website then you can open up the product that you just customized and you can take a look at your product page. So this is the display of the different product variants or the swatches for your product. And here is the mobile display of this section. If you'd like to adjust the appearance of the variants, when you click on the variant picker section, you can make a few different style changes to this section. You can turn it into a dropdown so that customers can select the color and then just select which option from the dropdown. This can be a good option if you have a lot of different variants to list. Then for the swatch shape, you can set it to circle or square or none, which should just show the names of the options. Next, I'll be showing you how to stack variants and also how to feature a bundle product on that same exact product page. Before you guys get to that, if you like this website theme that I'm showing you in this video, this is one of my Shopify theme templates. I designed this website template for cosmetic and skincare businesses. And I also have a line of other types of Shopify themes for cosmetic businesses as well. I'm going to link those in the description box below. If you're not too familiar with Shopify themes, the website template will arrive in a zip file format. And inside your Shopify store, you can click import theme and upload zip file. To upload that zip file into your store, it's going to install as a theme that you can customize and publish. And each of my theme bundles come with step-by-step -step installation guides to show you how to install them into your store. And for the new business owners out there, most of my themes also include additional templates like web banners, logos, and thank you card templates. I'm gonna link where you can check out my themes in the description box below. Next, I'll be showing you how to stack variants and then how to bundle a product and list that bundle of cosmetic products on your product pages. Inside your product editing page, you're gonna scroll back down to the variant section and then just click add another option. Then I'm gonna click create custom option. I've titled this product size and it's gonna represent the lipstick in different sizes, like a travel size and a full size. Then I'm gonna add an option value. Once you're done, you'll want to click done. You can click on the product size variant and add more or remove any if you would like. You can take a look at the different variant options. So it's gonna have a travel size and a full size option under each color. Just in case you have individual pictures of the product in its different sizes, you'll want to add those pictures accordingly. And don't forget to set the main picture once you're done, don't forget to add your inventory amount that you have for each product. And again, you can set different prices. So in this case, the travel size would be a lower price than the full size. Next, you'll want to click save. 
when you open up your website, you can open that product and you can take a look at the appearance of your product page now. So it's gonna list the first color options so that customers can select the color. Then it's gonna list another option where customers can select the size. Now to add a bundle of a product. So let's say you sell a few different lip glosses and then let's say you have a discounted bundle that includes all of the shades. For customers that would like to buy the set, I'm gonna show you how to add that product. So you wanna click products and then just go in to create a product as usual. And you're gonna list this as your bundle product. You want to proceed with filling in this product page for your makeup bundle product. And again, this will be for a set of products that you offer. Also, I know a lot of you guys are brand new to Shopify and there's a lot to learn when it comes to the Shopify platform. If you're still in the process of learning how to navigate the platform and set up your full Shopify website, I have a Shopify beginners training kit. It covers the Shopify setup process in an organized and easy to follow way. A few things the training covers is choosing a domain and learning how to navigate the basics of the platform, adding and organizing products, setting up your store setting like payments, shipping, and taxes. It shows you how to create pages and menus along with many more topics like your launch prep, Shopify apps, and marketing your store. The training also includes a 30 page digital planner to help you with keeping the overall backend of your store organized. I've designed it so that you can get all your setup information in just one place without having to surf the internet and get your information from dozens of different sources. I'm gonna link the training in the description box below. Next, you're gonna click online store and you want to go in to open up your website. Then you want to open up that product that you've added variants to. And I'm gonna show you a no code and a no app needed way that you can add a featured product. I'm gonna to scroll to the bottom of the page and in between sections, I'm gonna click add section to template. I'm gonna insert a featured product and you wanna make sure that the featured product displays below the product information box. After inserting this section, you want to select that bundle product that you'll be featuring on the page. And you can also adjust the appearance of this section. So you can adjust the appearance of the media, the media fit, and also the desktop media position. If you would like the image to display on the right or the left side of the screen on desktop. And that's how to add a bundle product underneath your main product so that customers can see their different options for the main item. And as they're checking out the product listing, they'll also see the bundle of products in case they would like to grab the set. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. You guys can grab this Shopify theme from my website. I'm gonna link it in the description box. And don't forget, if you're new to Shopify, I have a Shopify training, which walks you through the platform in an organized way so that you can set up your store and have it prepped for launch while also understanding the platform.